lots of things to talk about. So let me start straight away with the current situation. Sure. Uh, the investors and large numbers who came in in the last two years are perhaps for the first time seeing, seeing a sharp correction. fall and a correction. A um, lot of volatility in the market. What is your advice to investors to do at this point of time? Uh, instead of taking that question in the format which you put in, uh, let me go back a little and explain to the investors as to what should be the right way of investments and what should they understand to start with. Um, you know, if you show the picture which I have sent to you in terms of one person trying to cross the road hmm. in a zigzag manner, not on the zebra crossing and following the signal versus another person who's actually crossing the road based on the, and the signal, uh, you know, when it turns green, which one would you think would be reaching the other side safely? Naturally, the person who respects the signals. So I would like to tell the investors and the viewers that you please respect the market signals. Market is always giving you signals on a regular basis. Mm. So I have divided the markets into three zones, the red zone, yellow zone and the green zone. The red zone being the most expensive zone. Uh, that's when the signal asks you to stop you also need to stop and take a stock of your uh, investments at that point in time. Yellow zone being a reasonable zone where you can continue to stay invested or invest also. And the green zone being the most cheapest zone where, um, you know, that's where you should be investing maximum amount of money, uh, either through SIP portfolios, lump sum, etc. Hmm. So if you respect market signals, markets will respect you back. But if you ignore fundamentals, markets will give you a reality check which is currently happening. Mutual fund investments are subject to market risks. Read all scheme-related documents carefully.